So for the last seven days, the goats and I have been working this fence line at a farm nearby. Um, the homeowner has been wanting to come in here and clean this up for several years to get to the fence line that's in there. Yes, there's barbed wire in there. On the other side is a cow pasture. But to do that, he was gonna have to bring in a bulldozer. He's gonna have to put up temporary fencing to keep the cows in. Bring in a bulldozer, clear all this stuff out, take down the old fence, put up new fence, then take down the temporary fence. So this is going to be an example of before and after the goats, and then after the goats. So this is a before section. Um, we're about to move the goats into here in a few minutes. We just finished putting up the fencing. So this is before. There are the goats. This is what they've been doing for the last two days, cleaning up this section. Now you can see the fence. And what this allowed is for the homeowner to come in and he decided to chop down all these trees and just clear cut everything. So he'll come through after us, clean all this up. Now in the first section we did, which was actually the thickest section, uh, there was a lot of damaged barbed wire and stuff that he didn't even know was damaged until the goats got in there and cleaned it up. So obviously we do a little bit of trimming some limbs and clearing some stuff out. So this is what he did after the goats went through. Not ah, chewy, the fence isn't on. So this section here was actually thicker than anything else I've showed you. Um, and then he came in, there was, had been a lot of washed away stuff and it was a, kind of some steep drop offs here that he graded it out and leveled it up a little bit. It's still a hill, but uh, you can see where they cut down some trees and took them off into the woods. So there's still a little bit of debris left behind, but this was section one on this property. Chewie's caught up in the fence that he hasn't learned will zap him because it's not on. Section two that the goats just finished. We just brought Mike down today to join the girls. So now it's it's been 10 goats here and today we added number 11. They get kind of desperate when, when there's not easy stuff to get. This is section two and now we're gonna be starting section three here in just a minute. But before the goats came through, you can't see the fence in there at all. As you could tell from the first section I showed you at the beginning of the video. This is where section two and section three connect. They're ready to go. And oh, where'd the fence go? 